YouTube. YouTube. Yeah. Lions get fucking murdered. 42 to 10, 42 to 17. By the team I fucking hate. <laughs> Let me get started, man. Let me stop wasting time. The Lions, it's like in the first quarter, they was kind of, it was like this team is undisciplined. It's like the offense was moving the ball, but we always had that penalty that just draws us back. So that hurted us. We always had a fucking penalty that draws us back. Now, we couldn't get nothing fucking going on offense. We only had that one touchdown, Stafford to Theo Riddick, and that was it. That was the end of the game. Our game was over after that. After that, the game was over. You might as well turn the shit off. What happened in this game was motherfucking Cardinals kicked our fucking ass. They kicked our ass in this game. We play like shit. We are terrible. They, we play like shit. Straight the fuck up. We was garbage as fuck in the second quarter. We have seven fucking turnovers in this game. Seven fucking turnovers. We have fucking four in the first half. I mean, we have four turnovers in the first half. We have so many. F no. How many turnovers we had? Yeah, we had four in the first half. Well, four in the second quarter to be. No, four in the first half. I, I was right. Four in the first half. Second half, we had three. We was fucking garbage. What the fuck is this bullshit, man? We play like dog shit. We play like dog shit. Stafford threw three fucking picks. He went 20 of fucking 32. The Lions, they. They tied the NFL record in the most pass attempts in one game, this particular game. We was fucking garbage. Stafford was terrible. He threw three picks. Three of them was fucking bullshit picks. All three of them was fucking terrible. The first pick, he got picked off. It was that pick that he got, the first one, it looked like the exact same fucking interception that he got in against the Denver Broncos when we played them at home on a Sunday night football game to seal the game for the Lions. That was that was like the exact same type of it was like the exact same fucking outcome of that shit. It was like the exact same play and all that shit. That shit was fucking terrible. Why the I was like, why the fuck would he throw that shit? He it was it was the same results because Calvin Johnson. He wasn't open. He had one guy on him and two guys shifting to his side. It it was the exact the outcome was the exact fucking same. It looked so fucking it it was deja vu all over again. The second pick he threw. The second I know the offensive line they play like shit because they kept getting too many penalties. But I'm not gonna blame it completely on the offensive line. Stafford his second pick was so fucking embarrassing. This motherfucker got picked off on the running back screen. He keep and Joe Lombardi keep calling that fucking bullshit. Why the fuck you keep calling that shit? That shit hardly ever fucking works in the first fucking place. Why you keep calling that shit? That's why you need to get fucking fired. You suck ass, you son of a bitch. You suck. I hate your fucking guts. You need to get the fuck out of here. And Caldwell, you need to get your, you need to get your fucking. Twinkie head ass out of here too, you you stupid ass hoe. I can't stand your motherfuckers, man. Twinkie ass, he Twinkie head motherfucker, you chicken finger head ass motherfucker. I'm ready to, I'm ready for your ass to get the fuck out of here. I'm sick of this shit. Every fucking time we hire somebody, they always doing dumb shit. I'm tired of this shit. Mayhew need to fucking go with his bitch ass. His, his eyes is too little for his fucking head. You fucking asshole. And then Stafford, that pick to the defensive lineman was so fucking terrible. What it, it, The play was so fucking predictable. I knew that shit was going to happen. 
I'm like, he was the motherfucker was clearly covering his ass up. He was just waiting for you to throw the shit. And he still throw the shit. Stafford, it's like he didn't give a fuck. He like, I'm getting paid. Fuck you, bitches. Fuck you too, you fucking you fat bitch. I'm tired of shit. And he playing injured too. I think he is. I told you I'm done defending Stafford old, inconsistent having. I can't stand that motherfucker. I wanna ah, I wanna kill him. He sucks. Then the third interception. All three of his picks came in the second quarter. I mean, uh, two of his th- three picks came in the second quarter. His third pick came when he threw it to Patrick Peterson. Motherfucker. And he he was the throw. He he threw a bad throw. It was a bad throw. And he got picked the fuck off. I mean, I don't know what to say about that. Then the defense. They play good for a couple possessions, but then after that, they play like shit, too. Defense play like shit, too. Motherfucking, you don't just allow 42 points and not and not play like shit on defense. I'm sorry. You let Chris Johnson. Chris fucking Johnson? Chris Johnson? Really? Chris Johnson? To come in here and for the, the fucking den and carbon us up? The Johnson brothers was just carbon us the fuck up. Terrell Austin, I don't know what the fuck went on with, with your defense today, though. I don't know what the fuck went on. I think the I think the defense play like shit because of the offense play like shit. The defense was on the field the whole fucking game. A lot of the times. Every time the, the offense kept turning over. Again and again and again and again. I'm a Amir Abdullah. Why the fuck would you fumble that shit, dog? He ain't man. Why won't you hold that motherfucking ball in, man? Hold the shit fucking in. And then you fumbled on a kick return too. And then you ain't you ain't see Amir Abdullah for the rest of the fucking game. That shit. That's the type of shit that would get your ass benched so fucking quickly. You doing that Reggie Bush shit now, nah, man? You need to stop that shit. You need to change your jersey number or something, man, because you playing like that motherfucker right now, man. You playing like shit. Change your jersey number. Because when he wore this shit, bad luck happened. That number 21 number is bad fucking luck. Now, go to Tate. Why the fuck would you fumble that shit? Well, it wasn't really his fault, but it seemed like he... It seemed like his effort going down or something. Like he don't, he stopped giving a fuck or something. I don't know what the fuck wrong with Golden Tate. I think Golden Tate pissed off because the coaching staff and their bullshit. And I understand, man. Shit, hold your head up high, man. You going you gonna get another coach that that deserve that deserves to coach you because Jim Caldwell is a fucking joke. He's the worst coach in NFL history. I told, remember when I was telling you motherfuckers in my preview, this motherfucker got blew out 62 to 7, and his face expression then fucking changed not one fucking bit. Remember that shit when I said he got blew out 62 to 7 when he was we was the head coach of the fucking Colts? Remember that shit? That's exactly what happened today. He got blew the fuck out today, and he ain't show no fucking expression. He never changed the expression on his fucking face whatsoever the fuck ever. That's why I want his ass out of here. His bitch ass. Fuck him. I'm done. I'm done with that bitch. Me and my dad was so fucking mad, dog. I turned the fucking game off. And I don't turn games off that often, man. I don't turn Lions games off that often. You know I was fucking disgusted. I was mad as fuck. By the, by the end of the third quarter, I was done. I'm like, fuck this bullshit, man. I'm done with this bullshit. They put Darren Olowski in because Stafford played like absolute dog shit. And Olowski came in there and played better than fucking Stafford. Real shit. I'm not even going to hold you up. He played better than Stafford. Stafford needs to fucking go, man. I, I, I'm not defending that. I'm not defending that punk, man. That inconsistent-ass motherfucker. I'm tired of this shit. He playing He playing scared and shit. Like, the offensive line play like shit, too, but they... Not completely, though. They... they they got penalties. This team is undisciplined. Too many fucking penalties. Too way too many turnovers. Undisciplined as hell. Motherfucking Orlowski turned the ball over, but that was in garbage time. Fuck it. That's why I heard of he turned turned the ball over. I don't give a fuck. We had seven fucking turnovers. Just think about that. Set. 
You're not going to win a game turning the ball over seven fucking times. That's not happening. You might get winning. You might get away with two in two turnovers, but not fucking seven, man. That's ridiculous, man. You ain't gonna win the game like that. Stafford is a bum. I. That's why motherfuckers burning your jersey. You your wife coming. Your wife coming to your defense. Fuck that shit. You deserve every crit, critique and criticism you fucking get for the from the city of Detroit. I can't wait to listen to 97.1 tomorrow so Mike Valeni and fucking Terry Foster can just bash the holy fuck out of your garbage ass. I cannot wait. Out of my sick fucking pleasure, I want them to diss the shit out your weak ass. You trash as fuck. And I want them to trash. I want 97.1 to fucking destroy. Destroy this coaching staff. They're, they in over their fucking head. They're fucking stupid. Stubborn as hell. I'm tired of this shit. Fuck this team, man. Even though I love this team, but fuck this team right now, man. They on some bullshit. They on some bullshit. I don't know if you see that cat or not. I don't know. I don't know if you see it. But, yeah, man. The Detroit Kittens right there. Detroit Kittens. I don't know if you seen that. I don't know if you see it, but... That's how we fucking play right now. We play like pussies. The Detroit pussies, man. I'm so fucking mad. I thought the Minnesota Vikings game was fucking bad. That ain't, that game ain't got shit on this game, cuz. That shit ain't got shit on this game. That game ain't got nothing on this motherfucking game. We played 30 times worse in this game than we played in that game. At least in that game, we was a little more... Fucking competitive. At least we gave up a more. We gave more of a fucking fight. And again, in the next week, I'm not even 100 percent sure we're gonna win that fucking game against the Bears. And I hate that fucking team with a passion. I'm not even 100 percent confident we're gonna win that shit. Our team suck dick. Y'all just don't understand, man. I wanna. I'm turning my car on right now. I might end up going to motherfucking four field tonight, man. I swear to God. I know they might not be there right now, but I might end up going to that motherfucker. That shit is crazy. Ugh. I'm so fucking disgusted. Fuck this team, man. They don't deserve they don't deserve us fans or lo us loyal fan loyal fans for cheering this fucking sad ass team. But this video went on long enough, man. I, I almost I, this is the calm version of me because early I was throwing shit. So. I got nothing too much to say about this though, man. This this game was so fucking disgusting. Um, we play like pussies. The coaching staff, everybody need to fucking go. Martin Mayhew, fuck you. I hope you I hope you rotten shit, bitch. I hate your ass. You you are the worst manager in history. No, I take that back. But you are a terrible fucking manager. You're terrible. As long as you got experience from fucking Matt Millen, you are fucking garbage. You're terrible. You suck dick. This coaching staff suck dick. And I'm ready to throw this fucking phone right now. But I got to end this video right now, man. I got I got a hobby to fucking do. I got I got something to fucking do right now. Fuck you. I don't know if you can see this, but fuck you. Fuck y'all. Y'all y'all don't deserve shit from us fans. Fuck y'all. If you a fan, you bought tickets, get your fucking refunds. Because they don't deserve not a fucking dime from your ass. They don't deserve shit. Fuck this team, man. I hope they trade everybody, man. Fuck this shit. Motherfuck Some motherfuckers don't deserve this bullshit. But I'm out of here, man. Peace out, man. I had enough of this shit before I, before I kill some fucking body tonight. Peace.